ridiculous. It's ridiculous. But, hmm, but delicious. Well, hello and welcome to the Friday edition of Glen ZB TV, the show that puts Glen ZB into your TV. Uh, we'll start off with a bit of ass watch uh, this morning because um, I don't know if you've caught up with this news. There's a protest coming up in New Brighton, Christchurch. Uh, don't worry, it's not this weekend, it's next weekend. So you've got time to prepare to clench up because, yes, it's a mass mooning. Uh, local business owner Tony Brooks has organised this protest. Uh, he's not happy. I don't quite know what he's not. He's just generally not happy about earthquake-related issues. But I think generally it's just a good excuse for at least 100 people to turn up and expose their buttocks. Uh, this will be on the basketball courts by the New Brighton Library. So some of you may wish to attend. Some of you may wish to definitely not attend. I've doing, been doing a bit of research on the, on the efficacy of this sort of protest. Um, that's what it looks like in Australia when people protest this way. I don't, I'm not quite sure how you write stuff on your, on your own bum. Or do you get other people to do it for you? Not sure. That, that's not the kind of protest I want to be at. I'd prefer to be at this kind of a protest. Um, I'm not sure if they're actually protesting anything or they're just showing off their awesome bums. I think it could be the latter. But I'd rather look at that one. Anyway, I've got a bit of a bishop brouhaha. <laughs> I'm really stretching my alliteration skills to their limit there. Uh, bishop brouhaha, uh, this has been happening over the week. Uh, the CFB voted to not let women be bishops. Uh, which, you know, just stays in line with what they've been doing for, you know, hundreds of years now. Uh, and uh, so, because there, there are obviously problems, that's a bishop, and then if you let a woman be a bishop, then it ends up looking like that, and then of course the other pieces get jealous, and um, there's a lot of backbiting and, you know, bitching going on on the chessboard there, so just as well, I say. Uh, there'll be more, there'll be a great blog actually out tomorrow, Glenn ZB Silly Six Pack, on reasons why women should not be bishops. So don't miss that. Uh, hey, what's in a name? Uh, Aung San Suu Kyi uh, has told John Key to stop calling Myanmar Myanmar. Call it Burma, please. And I tend to agree uh, because uh, for a start, it's shorter. It's easier to spell Burma. And, um, and also nobody really seems to be able to decide how they're going to say Myanmar. Some people say Myanmar. Some people say uh, Myanmar. Emphasis on the ma as well. So Burma, no confusion. And um, mind you, look who's talking, Aung Suu Kyi. Your last bit of your name isn't even spelled with a CH, so I don't know what's going on. It's spelled with a K. How does that work? It's all weird, isn't it? But yeah, John Key, can we just change that around and start calling them Burma? Easier for everyone. Clears up a lot of confusion. And uh, oh, Feedback Friday! Yeah, baby! So we've got a couple of regular contributors here. Uh, Crowbard. Uh, he said, don't forget Clint Eastwood and also his chair. Yeah, I don't know. Don't know what that's about, but uh, good good feedback. Uh, Brian Lomaz, another classic contributor to Feedback Friday, wrote, No! Cooksville flatulence is bad, though. And he spelled, though, T-H-O-W. It's not your best work, Brian Lomaz, to be, to be fair. And also, I don't know what that's about. Um, statistics. Where are the statistics? I hear you shouting. Uh, new likes, two! Brilliant. Uh, still a little bit under the average that we learned this week. Of most people on Facebook, they've got 140 friends. I'm sitting around 119 likers there. So, yeah, if we can, if we can just pump that up by... I'd like to be above average if I can, if I can get there. Um, uh, people talking about this, zero. Not true. That's just a blatant lie. We've been talking about it all morning, or at least the last couple of minutes. Total reach. We don't know what that is, doesn't matter. Okay, that has been Glenn ZB for the week. Uh, I thank you so much for having me in your tally. <laughs>